Welcome back to Cocktails in Conversation. With me is Toby Bizzuto, who is the president and CEO of the Bizzuto Group. And we have to talk drinks. So yes. tell me what your favorite drink is. Well, I'm a big bourbon person. I love bourbon. And um, I used to drink bourbon with ginger ale, but have now downgraded to club soda. Fewer ca calories? Yes, yeah. I'm, watching, <laughs> I'm watching my young figure. And um, also, it's a specific, when, when we got the order. Yes, bullet. Bullet bourbon is the kind I like. So. so that's kind of a simple, straightforward drink. It's very simple. Bourbon and wa effectively water. Do you think that that's kind of a good reflection of you? Uh, probably. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know simple if I that's really... Be, yeah, I might be a little more complicated than my drink. <laughs> but, uh, but yes, I, it's, it's warm and comforting, and hopefully I, I'm those things. Ah. Right? Well, actually, and then I would say that then, speaking of complicated, the drink that um, Uzo Bay has made me um, is this fabulous thing. I have to look it up because there are so many ingredients in this, there's no way I was going to memorize it. It's called Blushing Nymph. Wonderful. And it has Reka Vodka, Ramazzotti Rosato, Ginger, Rose Water, and Lemon, and they float a rose petal on the top. That's Isn't that pretty? Nice. So cheers. Uh, cheers to you. started the company, yes. right? Yes. Now, for a lot of, of businesses, uh, you know, you hear about like the second generation kind of, you know, coming forward. It's not always a necessarily happy story. No. But it is with you guys. Not. You guys really seem to, and I, I, I know you guys socially, I know your parents. Yes. Um, we're really lucky. Why, why has regard. it worked? And, um, and you seem to like, rather than being forced into the family business, it's something that's really flourished. With yeah, I interestingly, I didn't join our company right out of school. I worked very briefly in the music industry, believe it or not. Really? Yeah. And um, I went to my father when I was about 23 and said, I'm not sure the music industry will be for me and I'd like to work for you. And he said, that's great, but I don't want you to come here to, till you work somewhere else for a few years in real estate, then go to graduate school, and then you can join. Wow. So I didn't join the company till I was about 28 after having done those, those things. And to answer your question, I think that created an environment where I, I had to earn, just like everyone else, um, yeah. the right to work there. Is there ever like an uncomfortable crossover from personal to business, like something like a disagreement business-wise, and it happens right before Thanksgiving? Yeah. <laughs> you know? and no, we'll, like, have oh. a, we'll have a very serious <laughs> meeting, and we'll say, and don't forget to call your mother <laughs> so, during the meeting. Like, can you not, can you not do that while we're, while we're here? So we keep a very definitive, typically, other yeah. than those rare occurrences. Right. We certainly don't argue there, um, but we try not to intermingle the personal uh, or commingle the yeah. personal with the the work, because it's not it's not really fair to others that are work there, that yeah. work there. So we've managed to completely separate it.